All right, here's a quick demonstration on how parameter switching can work. Um, so I got this event, it's got a discrete parameter. And on each section, I'm going to be playing a different song, so to speak. This is just an empty event, which is uh, just got a loop with nothing in it. And it's basically just to keep this event going um, when I hit play. Uh, so if I start, this one will be looping and it won't be doing anything at all. Um, and as soon as I change the value, it's going to fade into this one. It's got a fade in time and a fade out time. And here we go. There's the music. And if I go back here, it fades out. And as you can see, after four seconds, the audio stops playing. And I can make this a bit faster for so we can see it faster. There we go. Entering. And let's go out. And um, that was my phone. <laughs> and yeah, and this also works for uh, for these uh, switching between songs. So basically, it's switching to a different state. Um, let's go to four seconds again. And here is this one. Now we switch. And this one ends here. Uh, it doesn't have to do anything with the um, at the end of the file or something, since they are both looping. And if I apply the cut, in this case, it doesn't do anything at all. Um, it seems it seems like uh, F mod is uh, using the the uh, modulation, take, taking that one as priority. And uh, on the other hand, if we would uh, if we would remove the modulation here, we don't have cut on, cut on. That's when we really need. The, the audio will just continue playing. So if I change, it will just continue until the end of the file. And uh, yeah, that's problematic. So if I would do like this, yeah, it will trigger a, a bunch of them. And if I add cut on these, it will cut it directly. So yeah, that's, that's what it does. It k kills the instance, so. Um, but you still won't be getting a fade, so so yeah, you will need to add some modulation for that. There we go. Let's make it a bit nicer. And let's end it here. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> For volume, let's add the cut. Yeah, so that's how you do parameter switching with uh, with fades in F mod. Um, and you can use this for ambiences or for music or whatever. It's uh, really useful. So, yeah.